Whoa. Hello there, everybody. I'm just watching a replay duel right now. I know I'm starting a little bit early today. But I'd planned on starting even earlier. Yeah, punishments! So I redid the punishment wheel. I'll show you after the Sky Striker player absolutely destroys this Thunder Dragon player. He's getting his five dailies? Exactly. Holy shit. That's enough damage. Axe's code is gonna pop Sea Turtle and then 5,2250 for the creature. Whoa! Is the red section still unreadable? No, I made some changes to it, so it's more readable now. Let me show you. So, here's the new and improved wheel. Look at that, you can actually read what they say. So, um... I don't have a way to interact with this. We have, uh... We have the gamble deck. We have, I don't know what the white one says, chat decide something, there's the spicy option. There's the tsunami, the spider, RA books. I'll, I'll explain them if they land on any of them. Do you have the chip? I do. You wanna see what it looks like? I took a picture of it before the stream. This is it, one chip challenge. It was like 20 bucks for a single chip because it's supposed to be so spicy. So if it lands on the spicy thing, I'm going to take a bite of this. I am to do predictions? Excellent. Why just to give subs? Oh, okay. It, it is more readable, but I still can't really read the ones that are like sideways or upside down. Just one bite? Yeah, just one bite. It's supposed to be super hot. Mmm. How do you handle spicy? Well, I have spicy stuff all the time, but like, really mild spice. I don't actually go out of my way to eat actual hot stuff. Because I like to enjoy my food, not like... I, I probably have a higher than normal spice tolerance, but it's not like, that high. Tsunami? Yeah. The dual logs, baby. So I've been looking into this. How is the best way to do this? If I just play random decks for this, there's no stakes there. So I'm going to be playing Spriggan Time Thieves and trying to rank up to Plat 1. <laughs> the deck is probably good enough, but it's also not meta. So I'll probably still lose a lot. But I have a chance to win, so the punishments which modify the deck will actually be meaningful if I just play the same deck all night. Rather than constantly swapping to a bunch of random shit. Would a 60 card grass gamble deck work or even be a thing? Probably not. Gamble decks aren't really known for their graveyard effects. And the reason you play a grass deck is for graveyard effects. Before I play this deck, though, I have to show you this deck I was working on this morning, which I haven't deck tested yet. Spin the punishment wheel. Okay, so I, I, I made some changes to the rewards, too. <coughs> First, look at this. Lore accurate Wing Dragon of Raw. I can't wait to deck test this. This actually looks like it might win games. Okay, well, the wheel. Oh, I probably should open up the page for the wheel. I wish there was a button I could just push on my stream deck to spin this. You know, there probably is. I, I should probably look into that. I never thought to just Google how to do that. RA Books. Spider slash Akiza. Okay, so this one is, um, first off, the spider is now here for the full stream. 
If it lands on it again, then I have to unfortunately put up the Akiza model instead. And if it lands on it again, then it'll just be both of them. That's a pretty easy one. At least this one doesn't screw my deck over. The spider Akiza. Yeah. Alright, so let's get into Spriggan's Time Thieves. I'll catch up on chat. Win for us? I will. I'm gonna win all my matches because I'm playing Spriggan Time Thieves. Go with a 13 extra? Um. Okay, after this. Someone remind me for that. You have to do it in pat. Why didn't you guys tell me this before? No normal slash rare today? Uh, I don't want to talk about that event. <laughs> Ooh, I'm up first. Time Thief Regulator. <gasps> no, I can't do that. If I special summon it from my hand, then that's not going to be good. I also didn't draw any Spriggan, so I can't use my Field Spell card. Uh... Uh... If this card is normal... Uh... Um, if you control... Special Oh, it's just a quick effect to special summon itself from the hand? Should I special summon this now? To avoid... One of the specials? Yeah, I think I'm gonna do that. So I bring this card out... Maxi is going to resolve afterwards, which means they're only going to draw one card off of going into Redoer. However, this does mean I lose one extra card in my hand rather than using Time Thief Regulator to get two from the deck. At least that's what Time Thief Regulator does. Okay, and then I just pass and start stealing cards from the top of his deck. So Time Thief Redoer... Has an effect where during the standby phase, I can steal the top card of my opponent's deck. <gasps> Ooh, it's a spell card. And based on his materials, he can activate his effect. The good one is trap. If you steal a trap card, then he gains an effect to uh, return one card in the field back to the deck, which is really good. However, you can activate all of them. Like, it has a quick effect. You can activate all of his effects. And if he has a monster card attached, he can banish himself until the end turn. If there's a spell card, you get to draw a card. If there's a trap, then you get to spin a card. So if you have one of each, banish himself to dodge an effect, draw a card, and also spin a card. However, I can't do any of that because I didn't draw, I didn't get a trap. I wasn't really expecting to get a trap. This is just to stall out for a turn and hope I don't lose immediately. Hi, duelist people. Legendary warriors. Ancient warriors. Okay, so all I know about ancient warriors is that they have a Link 2 monster with a Spell Speed 2 bounce effect. <laughs> uh, target 1 continues to send it to the graveyard, and if you do add an Ancient Wars spell trap protect your hand, if another Ancient Wars monster's effect is activated, target 1 effect monster opponent control, negate its effects until the end of this turn. You can only use this effect once per turn. Um, I guess I'm activating his effect early and hope I don't die. Ash Blossom enjoy spring? Okay, well I guess Time Thief for Doer is dying. Well, at least I have a 2400 attack body on board to eat up one of their disruptions. So, target a continuous spell trap you control, send to the graveyard, they add an Ancient Warrior spell trap from your deck to your hand. Almost all the spells have when this card is sent to the graveyard from the field effect, be careful. Oh, hey, they made an archetype based on that one Link monster that Tri Brigade uses. <laughs> yeah. The only thing I know about them is the Link monster Tri Brigades use. Ancient Warriors Saga Borrow of Arrows. You can target one phase at monster you control. Uh, and when your opponent controls until the end of this turn, have that opponent's monster's attack. And if you do, add the lost attack to your monster, even if this card leaves the field. If this card is sent to the graveyard while well, you control an Ancient Warriors monsters with two or more attributes, you can place one Ancient Warriors continuous spell trap from your hand to your deck on the field. Except this card, you'll use this effect once per turn. While you control an Ancient Warriors monster, your opponent cannot target this card for attacks. You'll use the effect of this following effect once per turn. You can send one card from your hand or field to the graveyard, add an Ancient Warriors monsters from your deck to your hand. Accept this card. 
There's the dude that bounces. If your other Ancient Warriors monster's effect is activated, you can target one monster your opponent controls, return it to the hand. <gasps> this one, all Ancient Warrior monsters, 500 attack and defense. If this card is Link Summoned, you can add one Ancient Warriors card from your deck to your hand. Quick effects, a wood card from your hand or field to the graveyard, then target one face-up card your opponent controls and return it to the hand. What does this new one do? Hi, Mr. Logs. Hello there. You must send this card to the graveyard during your second standby phase after activation. Once per turn, during your main phase, toss a coin, call heads. If the result is heads, send this card to the graveyard. This card is sent from the spell trap cards onto the graveyard. Activate this effect this turn. Your opponent cannot activate cards or effects in response to the activation of your ancient warrior cards and effects. Also, to the end of the turn, all ancient warrior effect monsters you control gain this effect. When they declare an attack, destroy one card your opponent controls. What? Whoa. Oh no. Oh no, that's already a loss. Let's spin the wheel! <laughs> Gift subs. Okay. Oops, I accidentally turned off the spider because it's right next to it. Uh, Mogu streaming right now. I'll go over to Mogu stream and give some subs. You guys can go there too if you wish to confirm. Here, I'll, I'll put in the name of it. Okay. Uh huh. Processing. Okay. Actually, I can screenshot it. There we go. Okay. If we go to Spicy Pick. Why is it so tiny? And sideways. <laughs> there we go. Five gifted subs. Do war rocks? I'm not changing my deck. I can get a sub. It's the dual logs from the dual logs, dual logs, exactly. Hey, my Twitch Prime renewed. Hey, Mex Chaos. Thanks for the sub. <sighs> Do a Rex Raptor deck. I didn't get a sub, Sag Lodge. Pot of Duality. Ooh, should I chain Maxi to Pot of Duality? Is this an Exodia? Oh, no. No, this is a Banquet of Millions deck. Hmm. Hmm. Bot deck? Hey, they can still whiff. It doesn't have a 100% win rate. It's the DD Dynamite, 15 cards and extra depth, rip. How do you know they drew the combo? Card of Demise. Can't you negate Lilith? Uh, yeah, if he goes into Lilith, I can negate it. It's because he has Trap Trick. Trap Trick should search out one of the combo pieces, not all of them. Okay. 
All the cards go to the graveyard. Should be an easy victory from here. Sure, as long as they don't have the full combo. Banquet of millions. You think they have two DD Dynamites face down? He drew into to the both of the Dynamites bat. He needs a monster in the Imperm column to do it. Uh, I can't negate unless it's set first. Uh oh. I know he has a trap trick. One face down and a trap trick. Okay, well that's another quick loss. <laughs> High level gameplay. Time to spin the wheel. Chat decides? Oh no, I got demoted. Hmm, I need my extra deck though. I can't remove anything from it. Hmm. Hmm, thanks for the resubscribe, Solthus Enormous. Add time? Okay, if you say so. Okay, so what do you guys want me to do? I'll look at suggestions. And burn you for extra. Everyone saying feet deck? Lore accurate raw deck? Ancient Gears, Assault Modes, but no Stardust. <laughs> okay, I see some things that you guys are doing. Let me add them all to a poll. What to do? Um, um, there was one of the things I was going to put in here, but I forgot what it was. But now I have that. No, not Ligma. Hmm. Okay, I guess that's fine. Okay, start the poll. What's Ligma? Ligma's related to Sugnes. Thanks for the sub, Sedative Sword. Now I'm just waiting for chat to decide what they want. What does chat want? I bet I know what they're going to vote on. For the sub bobcat laser. Yeah, that does remind me. What is a good way to politely ask people to not bring up downer topics in chat? Because last night there was a lot of that. And I was like, I don't know how to politely say, um, you know, it's sad what's happening, but. Could you please not talk about it every five minutes for the next three hours? Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. I was just kind of... I, I didn't really know what to do, so I just ignored it for the rest of the night. 
And then afterwards, I was like, I thought of what I should probably do, and I couldn't come up with anything. <laughs> I was like, shit, I, I literally just don't know what to do. Uh, ignoring it makes the most sense? Yeah, I did, but that didn't work. Hmm, I think next time, like, it's fine. Like, it wasn't that big a deal. Next time, I'll just, uh, politely ask, politely but firmly. Be like, okay, let's not talk about that. Um, because, like, the big problem was, uh, Everybody in chat was also sympathizing, too. So, like, all of chat was just nothing but that. Thanks for the sub, Tamer Plague. So what'd you guys pick? Is the voting done? It has to have been a minute by now. Poll result. Why didn't it tell me when the poll was done? Oh, it's probably because of the, the hype train. Lore accurate raw deck? The feet obsessed chat actually voted for lore accurate raw deck? What the hell? Are you guys okay? I'm surprised feet only had so little. Someone contributed 51,000 channel points. Wow, even bits. It's crazy. Okay, let me remove some cards from the extra. So I don't instant lose to a banquet of millions deck. Everyone just misclicked, apparently. Hey, look, their, their thing is just a dartboard. I don't see how Deep Sea Diva is lore accurate. You see, Deep Sea Diva is a, a diva, and divas are loved by the gods. So, therefore, and therein... Yeah. Remember that classic episode where Yugi Lightning Storms Kaiba's attack position Maxi? Exactly! Oh, they're just playing, uh... What is it called again? Marionetter, um, Altergeist. <laughs> Deep Sea Diva's a raw worshipper. Exactly! Felt Plague resubscribed. Felt Plague's resubscribed? Why are you subscribed to the Yu-Gi-Oh! channel, Fel? Cyclitius. Secret Village of the Spellcaster. Okay, so it looks like Lightning Storm isn't working. Ghost Girl. Solemn Strike. Okay. The scoop Phase. I wasn't expecting a, a Secret Village of the Spellcaster. Well, I don't have anything else I can do. Good start? Yeah, for sure. <laughs> okay, so as long as they control a face-up spellcaster monster, I can't activate any spells. As soon as I can activate spells, though, I can blow up their back row. Soul Crossing, another spell card that I can't use. However, I can use Deep Sea Diva number two. Solemn Judgment? Wow, they're just going to kill themselves for me. A booba deck win? I don't have a booba deck. You need an 11 card in your extra deck for the version of DD Dynamite that uses Contract with Dawn Thousands? I'm not going down to 11, I need my extra deck. Okay. 
Set Karishin? Why? Oh my god. <laughs> Reactor Slime Protocol. Okay, Protocol doesn't do anything immediately. Cyclidius. Oh, she's gonna bounce it. Well, it would be nice if my opponent summoned more than one monster so I could actually use Ra to clear his field. I'm just gonna slowly lose to 800 pokes. Third Deep Sea. Well, I can't activate the third one. Deep Sea Diva's target is other copies of Deep Sea Diva. He's gonna kill you with a weakling. He can certainly try. Oh my god, another card I can't activate. Well, I'm gonna try... Oh wait, he can just keep doing that over and over. Oh no, there's nothing I can do because I'm locked with Secret Village of the Spellcaster. I have an out in my hand. Surprise stream? No, I stream at this time every day. Marionetter. You think he's going to get three cards on the field? No, there's no way. He knows I have uh, god cards. Reminds me of why I hate playing against Altergeist. This is the first time I've seen Altergeist use Secret Village. It's a good tech. I think that's going to win him the game. Set in Tribute? He can just bounce a set card, too. Hmm... What I need is... Um, well, I'll set it anyway. Okay. I would like to see a 100% non-effect normal deck. Hey, what? Oh, dang. Thanks for the five gifted subs, Jimbo. Oh, no. This is definitely going to be another loss. Not much, but I tried. Wait, what? Did you say something before that? Secret Village Man? Surprise stream? Oh. No, I stream at this time every day. Ooh, Ghost Sister and Spooky Dogwood. Let's set another card. Set one face down on the field zone. And then not be able to activate any of them because I'm floodgated. Buy a card which prevents anti-floodgate cards. Oh no. Secludius. How do you say his name? Silquitus? 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 Is there another Flaggid card like Secret Village of the Spellcaster? Yeah, Imperial Order. Dead by Tickles. Yeah, I got killed because I went second. <gasps> it's spicy chip time. <laughs> Let me swap over to uh, my Spriggan deck first so I don't forget. What happens if you roll it again? Well, I'm just going to take a bite. I'm not going to eat the whole thing. This is a huge chip. Let me see this thing. Ew, this chip looks nasty. I've been waiting for this moment my whole life. If you guys want to see what I'm eating, let me put the pick up on screen again.
Oh yeah, it's super huge by default for some reason. Oh my god, it's gigantic! What the hell? Oh my god! Oh my god, this is the biggest image in the world? What the fuck? Is this the moon? Apparently, it is gigantic! And it's sideways too! Oh my god. Mm -hmm. Okay, I finally got it. This is what I'm eating. The one chip challenge. I'm not sure why it's sideways. It's not sideways over here. Okay. Well. Alright, time to take a bite. Fuck all you guys! Fuck you oh, all! I hope crap. I fucking go to hell! <laughs> Ew. I'll be right back. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh my god, it's so hot. Oh my god, my mouth is on fire. Ugh. I have some almond milk here, but I don't know if this is gonna work. Oh my god. <laughs> It was just a bite. Ugh. Oh my god, this is doing nothing. Ugh. Oh my god. Oh, the aftertaste is gnarly as hell. This would probably be better with, uh, if you could actually see my... I guess that's not working. Oh my god, my mouth. Ugh. Oh, I have a banana right here. Ugh. A banana should work. Ugh. I'm just glad I didn't eat the whole thing like people were telling me. Ugh.
Don't touch your face. <clears throat> I redeem punishment with what does it do? Give me a shot. I'm currently dying right now. Ooh. I didn't think it would be that bad. Oh no, I touched my face. No, I already washed my hands, so I should be fine. Okay, someone says, um, someone redeemed a thing that said, uh, uh, no magic slash trap cards. Okay. It's also spinning the wheel. A banana was a good idea. I'm glad I brought one over. I forgot about it at first, though. Oh my goodness gracious. Okay. So it keys is up now. Um, where's the button for Akiza? Hello there. I'm not sure why the eyes are closed. Oh, well, it's probably because I'm turned over here. <laughs> Okay. Ugh. Okay. Alright. Well, I'm dying. Oh man, my nose is so runny. <laughs> gonna throw up for sure. Ooh. Add time? Okay. I'm trying to imagine a non-chibi Akiza. I'm not sure if either I want it or not. Why would you want a non-chibi Akiza? Oh shit, I should put more water I need more water Ugh. channel point predictions what about them oh yeah someone redeemed remove all spell traps from the deck okay um I'll remove all non-important ones I kind of can't play this without uh, the Seagon Goldia. The whole deck revolves around it. <laughs> there we go. Smiling, probably because my mouth is open. Whew. That wasn't so bad. Ugh. Man, I should just eat the rest of that on my own just for fun. <coughs> Duck? I can't tell if I look at it, it like it goes crazy. 
Oh, I have some ice. Cyframe Gear Gambit? No, I don't want to negate my own effect. I don't need it. Well, that wasn't even bad. That was a baby chip. Two logs. I thought you puked there. I thought I was going to puke too. <laughs> I thought I was going to throw up. <laughs> That's why I, I muted and like went to the bathroom. Like, I didn't think that would make me throw up. I didn't throw up. I thought I was going to. So I just cleared out my mouth, got all the chip out. Didn't swallow it. Okay. Well. Time Thief Adjuster. How much of the chip do you have left? I have like three fourths of it left. I did take a big bite, but I didn't take that big of a bite. Mm. Forbidden Droplet. I don't even need to use my effect. He just went minus two for no reason. <coughs> for no reason. The chip is large. Yeah, it's real big. What deck are you playing? Um, Time Thief Spriggans. Ugh. Would you take another bite if the will deemed it? Of course I would. That's what it's there for. Ugh. You can't have two bets running at once. Wait, what was what bets do you guys want? Destiny here, Malicious, is activating its effect in the graveyard. Does it banish as cost? I didn't even know you had Malicious in the grave. Ugh. The previous bet hasn't been redeemed. What bet? Oh, the previous one. What was it? Um, manage predictions. Choose outcome. Did I win the last one, or did I lose? No, I think I lost. There you go. Opponent is normal summoned. Would you like to activate the effect of a card? No. Your new model is so dopey. I love it. Why, thank you. It's meant to look dumb. Since I have it as a joke, I feel like if I had a, you know, an actual anime aesthetic one, that wouldn't really fit what I was going for. Okay. Maybe I should have left in the cards that search out Gone Goldia. Ugh. I guess the last one was a double? What? What are you guys talking about? Did the spider evolve? The spider's still there. I don't know. Can you guys see when I'm looking at chat? And when I'm paying attention to the game? I can't tell. On my end. Because of the stream delay. Yeah. Okay, well I guess it's working to an extent. This thing goes crazy and like moves like a lot, doesn't it? <laughs> um, If I had a level 4 in hand, I could actually go into my cards. But I don't. So, I'll just set Ghost Bell in the Haunted of Mansions and pass. Ugh. Your voice would be great for highly edited videos. You should consider making them the dual logs, the dual logs, dual logs. I was thinking that too. Maximum C. Come on, go for some special summons. I dare you. 
I double dog dare you. Probably wasn't the best deck to do a no spell card duel with. Hey, I mean, like, the punishments are not for making a good deck, you know. They're for making your deck as unplayable as possible. Okay. I still feel like I might throw up. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, that chip was dangerous. I want to redeem another punishment wheel. So what I thought I would do for Friday nights is lower the cost of the punishment wheel, but just give like a five minute cooldown. Um, well, fucking sh sh shoot. No level 4 monsters. And no furniture. I can go into Nightmare Unicorn, activate Branga, search, but I can't use it because I need a card in my hand. Okay. Tribute for Nibiru? He'll just destroy it in my next turn. Nibiru is better in my hand because Nibiru completely shuts down heroes. It's the will that never ends, just spins and spins, my friend. Elemental Hero Shadow Mist. He has three cards on the field. Time to count summons. That's one. <gasps> Summon number two. X-Crosser. Special summons a Destiny Hero Monster from the Graveyard. Targeting Celeste. Shadow Mist is going to search out a hero monster. Uh, I could shut down the special summon, but I want him to summon because that gives me more cards towards Nibiru coming out. This is two summons so far? Yeah. Well, he's about to get a third summon right now. Summon number three. Oh. Oh, and then his hand. He has... Wait, what? Tribute to Destiny Hero Monster? Add a Hero Monster with a different name from your deck to your hand? Okay, that's fine. What's he going to add to his hand? Four when mass change. Malicious. <gasps> is this tribute number five? Or is this number four? Well, actually, Nibiru will let me know. Yeah, that's number four. The fifth one is coming up. Can you create an updated version, Unexpected Fusions? I want to. I plan on it. Vision Hero Increase. No, I'll let him get the card on the field first. Vylon. Vylon activates its effect to add a Polymerization from his deck to the hand. Now it's time for Despair. Now it's time for Nibiru. He's going to... One card in order to add Palmerization. I'm getting greedy. I want to hit him after the Palmerization so that he has no hope. There goes the Palmerization. No furniture. <laughs> you got rock. I know. I'm, I'm waiting. He doesn't know because of DD Crow. Exactly. Because I've been responding to him ever since he started his combos. Sunriser. Okay, never mind. I'm waiting for this. The. The Miracle Fusion first. What's his effect when it's sent to the graveyard? By the effect of a spell card. Special summon. Oh, he gets a special summon Stratos from the grave. Let's, uh. <laughs> I'm going to do this just to screw with him. Make him think that's my only response. Make him feel safe. Safe enough to use the Miracle Fusion to banish some resources from the graveyard for me. There goes Miracle Fusion. Come on, use Miracle Fusion. You know you want to. If he saves it. I'm going to, uh... Well, that'll, that'll be bad. Because it means I'll be able to Nibiru him after it, 
which won't do anything. He knows now? No, he doesn't. That, the DD Crow was there in order to try and sell it. I think what he's doing now is confirming which card he wants to go into. Decimator. Okay, maybe he's just getting more cards in the grave. Okay, and then Miracle Fusion. Come on. End the main phase. God damn it, seriously? <laughs> he freaking saved it. Oh my goodness gracious. Oh, he didn't use it! What the hell? Oh my god, another one. <laughs> what are the chances he'll give me the opportunity to use it? No one expects the second Nibiru? Yeah. Liquid Soldier. Oh, he might get the, the summons off again. He, he still has Miracle Fusion in his hand. Oh, and he's going to search out a Mass Change, too. That's two summons. Shadow Mist is going to activate. For Mass Change. No one expects the, the third Nibiru. <laughs> what are the chances I'll be able to get three of them again? Uh, impossible. Look at him go. He's afraid of Nibiru, so he's not going to combo off this time. Elemental Hero Shadow Mist. Oh, he, no, he's just attacking with Liquid Soldier. He has, still has Miracle Fusion in his hand. He has a mass change, and he ain't doing nothing. He's too afraid. Infinite Impermanence? Okay. Um, set this on the field. I got nothing. The mass change. Okay. I was going to destroy my back row, huh? And it's dead. Somebody need beer three times to win? He's stream sniping? I highly doubt someone with the Japanese name is stream sniping. More like he was just, he had the fear of God put into him because of the Nibiru. Thanks for the 100 bits, boss patrol. Okay. Let me change the deck back to non-terrible status. Okay. Uh, I'm pretty sure I had other cards, but I think this is fine. All I did was remove a whole bunch of staples. No, I should probably add terraforming too, at the very least. Oh wait, I lost, didn't I? Hmm. Let me spin the wheel real quick. What is it? Oh. Oh. Okay, Spriggan's watch. <laughs> Gone Goldia. Send this dude to the grave. Bring out Mary Maker. Shut up, don't give me no sad violin. You guys don't deserve a sad violin. Okay, and then we'll attach both of them from the grave to this card. Okay, this one too. Uh, select one of your cards. Alright, and then we'll set this. Alright, and um, let me eat the chip during this duel. A 
I'm gonna take a, a small, tiny little bite. God, I took a huge chunk last time. No wonder I was dying. Ah! A whole bunch of it came off. Oh, hey, I have 20k points. Why do you have 20k points? Ugh. Oh. <laughs> mm. <coughs> oh, it's disgusting. So nasty. Somebody redeem punishment, Will? Why? Stop redeeming the punishment, Will. Have I not been punished enough? Ugh, that was so nasty. Normal summon Pedor. Not enough? Oh man, even a tiny piece is fucking me up. Oh my god, why did I take a huge ass bite last time? That was crazy! Hopefully you guys can see my suffering better with the model out. If not, then the model would have been for nothing. Uh. <laughs> Smiling the whole time. <laughs> oh Tornado Dragon Hmm Redoer Yeah, Tornado Dragon. He's just gonna destroy it anyway. You count as a VTuber now? No, I'm not a VTuber. Why is timeout gone? Because it was annoying. Ugh. Cowabunga, my dudes. Skill drain? Ugh. Did chat make you eat a ghost pepper? Something like that. <sighs> okay, I don't have an out to skill drain in this deck. Because <sighs> I removed all my lightning storms. <clears throat> Ooh. <sighs> Should have done something else debate skill drain. I hate it so much. I forgot skill drain was an option. I don't have a. Oh man, I'm gonna throw it. Ooh, Nibiru. That's neat. <laughs> it was a tiny thing. Is the redeem punishment will executed yet? Let's do it now. Ooh, what is it?
Oh, gamble deck next. Okay. That's fine. Whatever. I need more water. Ugh, at least it's not more chips. Link Spider. Ooh. The gamble deck poggers. Yeah, exactly. Old Lich of the Golden Lords. Why do you keep sighing? I'm not sighing. I think. Whew. Just hoping your health issues won't get exasperated. I don't have any health issues. Whew. Okay. Um, I don't think I have an out to skill drain in my deck, and I need my skills in order to win. I think it's best if I just surrender here. Why is Imperm set in the wrong column? Because uh, he activated that before I knew about it. <laughs> okay, wheel time. Spin the wheel. What is it? Gamble deck? Well, I'm already playing the gamble deck. So, neat! Ugh. Man, my stomach hurts. My stomach heart. World Chalice, Guard Dragon, I can remove this, and I can remove this. There we go. Let's go. Let's go gamble deck. Whew. I'm still recovering from that chip, oh my goodness gracious. Why no full extra? Uh, so I don't instantly lose to DD Dynamite again. Mr. Long, is he gonna play Tour of Doom? No. My gamble deck's amazing. I only play good cards in my gamble deck. Uh oh. That's not good. Just get rid of Chip from the wheel? I'll make it smaller. Okay, it's smaller now. It shouldn't come up as often. Okay, Shimeti special summons Madame. What's her name? Vere? So she has a quick effect to negate all of my monster's effects. However, it's not permanent. And it's not a floodgate either. So if I can use two effects, I can destroy her card. Once per turn, witchcraft or monsters cannot be destroyed by battle or card effects. Well, that kind of screws over a lot of my strats. First up, let's bait... No. Should I bait with instant fusion first? Hmm. Have you got any sugary things in the house? It should help with the heat. Milk will just make it worse in the bathroom, that is. Sugary things? No, I have a banana. That works. Fuck, I don't know what to do. So if I instant fusion, I can go into Tomorrow Wizard and probably bait out a destruction save. Um, this card right here is annoying. But if I go into Snipe Hunter, I can keep trying to destroy the card as much as I want. So I think I'm going to go with that. First time Wizard of Tomorrow. To destroy Madame Eva. Or at the very least, bait out the negate. 
There it is. Discard one spell, negate the effects of your opponent's face up monsters. Okay. There goes negate number one, and then we have Snipe Hunter. Snipe Hunter's turn. Snipe Hunter. Uh, discard, and two thirds chance to blow it up. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> I need to do this twice. This needs to resolve two times. Okay, that's the first one. Time number two. Okay, it only took three cards to destroy it. Easy peasy. And then I can go into Preda Plant, Verte Anaconda, and then do nothing because my only other cards are Super Polymerization. So, uh, just attack for 1,500 points of damage and then cry because I, uh, I'm destroyed by this Buy Street card. <laughs> Goodbye, Time Wizard of Tomorrow. Worth? He's gonna win? I don't know about that. So this is Mr. Logs from the Dual Logs, Dual Logs? Yeah! Wait, what? I saw someone redeem another spin? What? Okay. Spin the wheel. What is it? Spider? Okay. So, um... Ah! It's so big! Oh. Uh... Response? The spider is so huge and it takes forever to make it small. It's also not on the right layer. Let me move it up one. There we go. I can't get my face because I'm turned completely to the side right now. There we go. Your opponent is about to end their turn. Man. Stupid by street. The mustache. Okay. Vanity's emptiness. Well, that would have been useful a turn ago. Um. Okay. There we go. And we'll move it over. There we go. Perfect. Front and center. Would you like to activate the effect of your card from the graveyard? Yeah. I totally haven't lost. And I'm just stalling for time. Called by the grave? Are you kidding me? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Hey guys, let's let's spin the wheel again. Woo. Woo. I have to play this deck again. What does that say? Master pack? Okay. So Master Pack. This is um <clears throat> One of two things. It's either just open a master pack and then add all the cards to my deck, or uh, how many cards are in a master pack? Is it 10? It was or open up a bunch of master packs and then make a deck with what I get. So... 
And if I open up five master packs, I could build a deck from that. However, I don't want to do that. I'll just open up one master pack. And I'll just add every card to the deck. Easier to do with a new account? What new account? Oh, not half bad. This is going in my gamble deck, though, so adding an extra copy of Rocky isn't going to help. <laughs> but Sandgen is usable. The other cards are uh, garbage. And I only have two literally unusable cards. So that's an improvement. Alright. I need to play the gamble deck one more time. Sandgan, yes. Yeah, Sandgan's great. Okay. So. What I should do for this deck. Is put in more Ecclesias, remove some Sasuke Samurais, remove one of these, and also add in um, Alpha, because he is an Alpha, an Alpha male and an Omega. Also remove this, add in... and add in a Skull Wagon. Okay. All right, now the the master pack. Two Nibiru's for less bricks? No. Three Nibiru's are I'm not playing Nibiru. Okay, so cards which I just obtained, one Rocky, one Sandgan, one Hydro Barrier, one Mecha Phantom Beast Turtle Tracer. One Friendly Donkey, one White Stone of Legends, one Malkotoda, Artifacts Unleashed, and that's it. That's, uh, wait, isn't there ten cards in a Master Pack? I don't think I opened these two cards. Like, that was it, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. No, there's only eight cards. You guys lied to me. You said there was ten. Okay. I'm totally going to win this time. I'm not going to lose ever again. Can't imagine playing Maxi or Nibiru without the other. Do I don't have Maxi in this deck? I should have three copies of Maxi. Oh, wait one second. I forgot to put my almond milk away. 10 packs, 8 cards per pack, 80 cards. Mmm. <gasps> Ooh, one of the great things about these useless cards in my hand is uh, Snipe Hunter turns them into useful cards. Ho ho ho, easy win. Let's see if they were playing Banquet of Millions. Yep. Bot. <laughs> did I call it or did I call it? D D Dynamite. D D Dynamite. FTK broken deck. He was afraid of the snipe hunter, right? Okay. Well, useless card in hand. You return one Iron Korg Mare from your hand to the top of your deck. If you do, the effects of all phase of effect monsters are negated until the next standby phase. Except for Koa Kira monsters. Well, he can at least be summoned. So, I'll set him face down. Set one face down. Set another one face down. End turn. You go down to gold 5 next season? Yeah. I can't see the bets. I don't think a mod is doing the bets right now. If you can't see it. Code Kimira, Hydro Bear. This is the last time I'm playing the Gamble deck unless I get it again on the wheel. I'm going back to Spriggins.
Oh, he didn't get anything. A complete brick. Fusion deployment. Um, the only thing this is good for is bringing out... Uh, Time Wizard. So I'll just go into this for a thousand points of damage. <laughs> just bet on the gamble. Oh, I plan on it. I have to save Lightning Storm just in case. Skip turn? Yeah, he just skipped his turn. Koaku Mira beatdown? Yeah, exactly. Crypto, how could you forget? What deck are they playing where they're not doing anything? Oh my god, they had max. <laughs> Do they just draw nothing but hand traps? Okay. <laughs> Attack slowly with a thousand points of damage every turn. Uh oh. Brick eyes? Are they playing blue eyes? I have no idea. Look at him choke. I didn't choke. Crypto for Gar. I played against a dozen people who just ended today. Hey, if, if I get play against a dozen people who do that too, that's good, because I'll instantly win. End phase. Oh my god. Add Emancipators? What? Okay, now I know they're just trolling. That was a perfectly playable card. What the hell is that? Is this a bot? It's a bad bot. Yeah, setting Ash would be better. That would actually require me to use some resources to get rid of it. Do 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 Um, okay. They're waiting for a, a five lightning storm, apparently. Oh my god, another ash! <laughs> is this, is this game? If I use fusion deployment... Uh, whose name is the card? I can bring out another card, which will bring it up to 3,000 points of damage, which isn't enough. Okay. I didn't think Hydro Beatdown would be so effective. They're not trying to win, they're trying to grind daily gems. I mean, this is a really inefficient way to go about it, if that's the case. Maybe they're waiting for the life point value to get to a, a low amount? That way they can go into one of the Utopia cards? Bot testing? Probably. Wait, what? Been up for 16 hours, I should sleep. Psh. Psh. Who needs to sleep? Ooh, perform a pal friend donkey. No applicable effect for Performer Pal Friend Donkey. I'm gonna have Hydro Barrier attack for game since he's been doing the most work. Okay. Let's uh, take a look at their, their chat. Not their chat. Their deck. I want to see what deck they're playing. Match history. Confirm opponent's deck. They were playing at Emancipators. I 
I didn't do anything. <laughs> Maybe trying to derank? I mean, I guess if he just was too lazy to build his self burn deck, sure. Well, at least I don't have to play this deck anymore. Oh wait, I should probably edit it first. I'm from 3k to 39.9k today. Have not lost a bet yet? Damn. Alright, so what did I put in this deck? The Sand Gan doesn't seem like a half bad addition to the deck, to be honest. But only not half bad. Still not good. Okay, we can move Rocky. Remove Nether Lord. Alright, it's at the 40 cards. Looks like it's good to go. But for Gar to switch to Banquet. Boss Patrol with the 69 bits. <laughs> back to back. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Select deck. Edit deck. So, I forgot to add in Lightning Storm. And for Lightning Storm, I'll replace um, two copies of this and that. That seems good, right? What else am I missing? According to my list, I need Maxi, Nibiru, and Permanence, Forbidden Droplets. Oh, I don't have that. Lightning Storm, uh huh. And the uh, only thing I'm missing is Droplets. That's fine, this is good enough. Okay, Spring and Time Thief should absolutely win every duel, 100%. I can't imagine losing every duel with this deck. Imagine losing all your duels with a deck that you're trying to win with. That's crazy. Add Twin Twister? No, that's what Lightning Storm's for. Lightning Storm's better. Um... Do 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 you think I can bait out an ash with this? Well his name is 99%. 99% what? Time the regulator, yay! I get out my full time thief combos. Activate winder first to search and then adjuster to chain block. A mob psycho fan? Mmm. No bezel ship? <gasps> no furniture. <laughs> time Thief Winder. We'll add Time Thief Retrograde. And then go into Time Thief Redoer. Even though I could go into the Sprig card. Okay, and then this one, and this one, and no face-up cards, because I want to be able to actually use Lightning Storm my next turn if I need to. You want to get random DCs and ranked? Nope. Activate Time Thief Redoer? Yes, I would like to steal one of my opponent's face-up cards from the top of their deck. Hopefully I steal a trap. Uh, no, but there was a high chance of stealing a trap because Magical Mustard Tears actually play traps. Uh, what's a maxi? Their best card is a Link 1. You can activate Magical Musketeers spell traps from your hand. If a spell trap is activated in this card's column, target one face of card, destroy it. Uh oh. Uh, I guess I'll negate it. Oh boy, I love this deck. Yeah, it's Spriggins. It's the best deck ever. Select a monster you control. <gasps> oh, I have a trap. That means I can spin. <laughs> That's not the same column. Uh, if a spell trap is activated in this card's column, you can add a Magical Musketeer card from your graveyard to your hand, but a card cannot with the same name. Ties of the Brethren. Okay. Well, that's, that's some nice advantage there. Two 
two cards from the deck. Oh, of course I get Maxi now. I mean, Joyous Spring now. You can add one Magical Musketeer card from your deck to your <coughs> Target with three cards, banish them. Target up to three cards in the graveyards and banish them. You can only activate this effect once per turn. What happens is this one has a card activated in its column. With this column, you can just card one Magical Musketeer card and draw two cards. Okay, I, I literally don't need those cards in my graveyard, so that's fine. So it activates its card to discard one and then draw two. Yeah, let's Ash Blossom that. Because they just go minus one for no reason. Called by the grave? <laughs> you mean they had that for the max C and they chose not to use it? <laughs> a two for one. <laughs> nice. He activated this column because this card, he's trying to activate its effect too. You can add a Magical Musketeer card from your deck to your hand, but not a card with the same name as the card that was activated. Good luck trying to search when your effect is negated. Time for him to scoop. If I were him, I would scoop. That is embarrassing. Should I use this effect? I have the spin. Yeah, I'm gonna do it now. Detach that. Detach this. Select a card to return to the deck. This one. And then he comes back. He could have summoned the Link. No, he was afraid of my Max C, so he didn't want to do that. Activate Redoer? Yeah! Whoa, I actually won! I mean, of course I did. This deck always wins. This deck wins so much that it I almost get tired of winning all the time. Oh no, did the thing just freeze? Why does it always look like it's frozen when I look at it? Is it not tracking? Well, whatever. I don't give a shit. Okay. How long have I been at this for? An hour and a half. <laughs> Still have another hour of this. <laughs> Mr. Dulog is a VTuber now? No. I'm not. I don't know what would give you that impression. This is a punishment. These are up because of punishing stuff. Doubters get big. Nice 16 gems. That was that was a lot of gems actually. Rip musketeers. I should probably convert my desk to a sitting so I don't stand for the rest of the night. Okay. Well, I didn't. Oh no, I have one right here. Uh, yeah, time thief winder. If I add that one girl to my hand, does it meet the activation window to be special summoned? I'm about to find out. Nope. Spriggan's watch. The spider is um there. What's wrong with the spider? You don't like the spider? I can't see. Every time I look over, it like freezes. Nope. If I do anything but look directly at it, it goes crazy. Okay, we'll get rid of Sargas. Special summon out Merry Maker. Merry Maker's effect. Send, um, mm, I already have that one in the grave. If I send brothers, I can bring it back and have destruction. Oh, maybe I should try doing that. Brothers, bring back Captain Sargas into defensive position. And then activate brothers in order to attach to this dude. Okay. The spider's controlling Nikiza. 
Yeah, exactly. Sorry just to cough there. I'm still not really over the chip I ate at the beginning. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna convert my desk to a sitting one real quick. Look at how crazy the model goes when I move around. Okay, I should probably adjust it so that it's facing me better. Zoom. Blah. Okay, what are they playing? Oh yeah, let me calibrate. I don't think you can uh, see my eyes through like the thick glasses I have right now because my eye was hurting. Um, destroy one face-up card on the field. Yeah, that's an excellent target to destroy. Can't let them get off void imagination. That card is redunculous. What does Void Imagination do again? Wait, when were the effects negated? Fuck! <laughs> I didn't even notice the Dark Ruler! <laughs> Why didn't you guys tell me he Dark Rulered no more to me? I owe it's the dual logs real? Sure. What does it look like when I look at chat? Oh, it just looks like I'm slightly looking over. Actually, if I just move it slightly to the left, it should be centered more often than not. Well, all my cards are dead. If he sends uh, three Natisses to the grave, it's been the punishment. Well, did someone redeem it? Ooh, I get to send cards too. Cool. Uh, I have a merrymaker. Let's send uh, a unicorn and a tornado dragon. Neat. Spin the punishment wheel. Okay. What is it? Spider? Oh. I've already reached the maximum amount for that. I have to redo. Um, chat decides or spicy? I think it's slightly on chat decides. What do you guys want? Spicy? Chat decides? What is what is chat one? Now this is some VTuber content I can get into. I'm not a VTuber though. This is only there because of a, a punishment. Oh wait, one second. I should probably uh the model moved a lot when I was changing stuff. I'm just gonna do this so it stops asking me to use the effect that's negated. Okay. Let me uh, move this a bit. Maybe I should make it a little bit... Not that big. There we go. That way you can't see the whole body. Okay. Don't get used to this. This isn't going to be here forever. Alright, so what did you guys uh, pick? Furry deck? No, I'm not going to build any decks on stream. Play prank kids? No. Feet deck? Feet Eldlich? Mayakashi Mill or Pure? Your choice? Chant decides? Frog Eldlich? Uh, normal, only ranked and... Hmm... All right, let me manage the pull. Uh, Kizo Spider, 60 cards. Uh, looks like you guys just are... Lore Accurate Raw. Feet Deck. 
play DD Dynamite. I, I think I deleted my DD Dynamite deck. Normalware Festival deck. <clears throat> okay. You must have a question. What is Punish? Okay, activate Iron Dasher from the extra deck from the graveyard. Yeah. What are you gonna do? Select one card to special summon. Rocky. To the field. Yeah. Rocky activates its effect. Add back. Uh. Brothers, I guess. Strikers, but always a common. But always a summon the main monsters. I'm not building any decks. Only decks I already have. Ooh, Spriggan's Booty. Nice, this lets me get the field spell card. How many cards are they playing? They're playing a full 15 card deck. They don't fear bots. Feet, Spriggan's Butt. Wait, did they banish this? How did they banish the cards on my field? Oh, that card. I wasn't paying attention. The feet deck won? Of course it did. You guys are a bunch of degenerates. Schism? Are they gonna go into a fire monster? Oh wait, if they go into Purgatrio, that's bad for me. The monkey deck? Uh, I think they're just going into window. Okay, Axe Blower. Wind is fine, all my monsters are fire. So, no non targeting destruction. Activate P door, targeting Axe Blower. I know he has an effect to, like, get rid of my shit. I don't know why he's not doing it. He can tribute a card in order to banish a card from my graveyard, but he's not doing it for some reason. Feet? Feet one? Oh, I saw. You guys have to... You guys... Wait a second. I can't go to feet right now. You guys are just gonna have to hold your feet... Uh... Just gonna hold your, your horses... Hmm, if I target here, I can destroy those two. If I target here, I can't destroy Schism because it's too far away. So, let's just do this for now. Spriggan Exa Blower. Target this. Window can't be destroyed by card effects. So there's no point in trying to do that. I see what you did there. Feet spell four. What the hell are you guys talking about? What in blazes is the feet deck? It's, it's not as funny as you think. It's just a whole bunch of cards that have, like, feet in their names. Being just one card on the field? Ooh, that means I need to keep one more material than I thought. It's Twitch chat only, unfortunately. I'm new here. Why does everybody like feet? I don't know if they like feet or not, but they sure do like to spam about it. Yeah, I don't know why you waited so long to use that effect. <laughs> You're banishing a card that doesn't matter if it's in the grave or not. Okay, we'll put, uh... Oh, no, I don't want to do two of them, just one. Destroy this card. Technically doesn't target. Okay. Um... Summon Time Thief Adjuster. No reason to send a card to the grave. They don't have anything else, right? I should just be able to attack with Exa Blower and destroy Window. Without having to worry about anything. Snow is coming out. Oh, I forgot about Snow. Holy shit, how does he have so many cards in the grave? Oh, he resolved in Monster Gate. What the hell was with his opening hand? Holy shit. Okay. You are a meme feat streamer. Shut up. 
Grass? He didn't use grass. He just used a uh, monster gate. And got a whole bunch of cards in the grave. His whole graveyard is live right now. The problem is they don't summon three times, so my Nibiru is useless. Reasoning? I negated the reasoning. I remember that. I didn't know they also had managed to resolve Monster Gate. So they opened Monster Gate, Reasoning, Dark Ruler no more. <laughs> what the hell, man? Oh, they have to get rid of their own window so they can go into other cards. And grass? They didn't use grass. Oh, they might have banished it with snow. Oh my god, they resolved grass too? What the hell was their opening hand? Let me check the log. Five cards, I set up my combos. Okay, and then my opponent goes reasoning, ash blossom, desires. Uh, Dark Ruler no more. Void Imagination, which goes through. Infernoid Tiara. Hap Cologne. Monster Gate. No, Monster Gate milled grass. Merrymaker. Tiara. Banished all my stuff. Okay. Oh, am I going to get to use Nibiru? Oh! <gasps> <gasps> Are they gonna give me a Nibiru? He's gonna okay OTK you with access code. Oh, uh, once they go into access code, I'm blowing it up. Nib with the face down card in the field. I know this is actually not half bad. He's scared though. He saw a little bit of a delay. terraforming he's not going into it anymore layer of darkness is gonna try to tribute one of my cards first Psh. oh wait he can just do it as a quick effect however it hasn't gone live yet so you have to tribute one of your cards <laughs> Hope you have a nice sleep. Try to go to sleep. See ya. Oh no, he's getting rid of one of my dudes in the grave. Uh, I'll put my guy in attack position. Because I fear no man. And then this one in defense position. Neat. And that gives me a token. Actually, Art Spring is very good at dealing with Winda in general. Yeah, because I only special summon once. But he used Snow in order to flip it down. They only have nine cards left? Holy shit. They still have, like, all of their Infernoids. For those of you who don't know who, how Infernoids work, basically they summon themselves from the graveyard by banishing other uh, Infernoids from the grave. However, that's only based on the amount of levels on the field. Wait, he shouldn't have been able to do that. Uh, by banishing two Inferno monsters from your graveyards, while the total levels and rings of all effect monsters you control are eight or less. Oh. It ignores tokens because they're normal monsters. He has 2,500 defense, so he's beaten by this attack. Oh my god, that's some bullshit. Then he can target one card in the field and banish it. Oh, he targeted that, huh? Oh, it's going to tribute my card in order to banish a card from the graveyard because they actually hadn't activated the effect yet. Damn it. Here I was hoping that this Nibiru token would have screwed him over, but it's only effect monsters. Yeah, this is another loss. Oh, and he gets the token? What the hell? Lightning Storm? To destroy all of his face down cards? The 7,400 attack token? I probably should have put the token. No, attack position would have been stupid. Um, 
man. I'm dead. <laughs> Destroy all their spell traps, I guess. Whatever. Oh, what won the poll? I wasn't paying attention. Wait, you're not playing the normal rare event? No, that event, uh... Let's just say we don't get along. Let me view the results of the poll. Oh, feet deck one. Right, I forgot about that. Why? Don't ask. It's it's no it's no it's nothing. Okay, so you guys want the feet deck, right? I'm not gonna show you what's in it. Well, you guys already saw. All right, it's time for feet deck. Oh wait, I have to do another punishment too because I just lost again. All right, spin the wheel. Oh man, I was coughing. Um, <laughs> no, no, it's more spice. Not again. I just got done recovering from it the first time. <laughs> I'm gonna do it. I ain't no coward. I'm afraid of a lot of things in life, but I still do them anyway. Okay. It's time for spice. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. Oh, so nasty. All right, let's we'll just, just do this. Oh, I'm never doing the chip thing ever again. This is a terrible idea. Oh, it's so nasty. <laughs> what type of spice? <laughs> this is what I'm eating for people who are new here. <laughs> <laughs> It's so nasty. Oh, I think I'm gonna throw up. <laughs> okay. Ooh, I drew my feet. Ugh. I'm gonna destroy my card. Search out dual avatar invitation. Set this card. Activate dual avatar invitation. Why do you do this to yourself? I didn't think it would be this bad. I mean, Avatar. I mean, Avatar seems like he's having a good time. Oh my god. Oh, I'm gonna throw up. Oh, no, I'm fine. Man, even just a little piece of it is ridiculous. Holy crap. <laughs> Activate Eldritch the Golden Lord Boy. Summon it to the field. Heck yeah, Eldritch. What does this card do? <sighs> You're gonna have interest time in the bathroom. Oh, I ate like half of a chip. I'm sure I'll be fine. I can see why streamers are playing the ladder over it. What happened? I want to refund. My sound clip wasn't audible. Why the sound clips are having problems. Let me take a look. Oh, my mouth is on fire.
Okay. A kaiju? I don't even know what this card does. Target dual avatar monster control. Destroy, and if you do, spell some a dual avatar monster from your deck or extra deck whose original level is one lower or one higher than that monster. Uh, uh. uh during your main phase, have to turn this card sent to the graveyard. Banish this card from the graveyard. Target dual avatar monster to the graveyard. Add it to your hand. Okay, those are some good effects. Level six, do I have level seven? Oh, he's gonna banish it now? What the hell is he banishing feet? Is he brick? Oh, I do have a level seven. Harpy's feather duster. Okay. And I'll use this one too. Target this. Destroy that. Special summon empowered feet. That's his name, right? No. Select a monster to special summon. Oh, I can special summon Ash Blossom from the deck. Neat. Haha. <laughs> oh, I should have put this in defense position. First time each of your dual avatar um uh, fusion monsters will be destroyed by battle each turn. It is not destroyed once per turn during your main phase. Oh. Alright. Hey, Scorartio. Welcome to my hell. Blech. I need more of that banana. Kaiju Files is activated. Yeah, let's not let them do anything. Mmm. Okay. Now I won't be dying anymore. My skill is that tip. Oh, was I doing? S oh yeah, I was just checking the channel points. The random sounds button is it working? The test your reward. It's not working. How come it's not working? Make sure it's enabled and created on Twitch. Remove limits to test rewards not live. Mm. Is it because it has limits? There's no limits on it. What if I try changing the cost? Test rewards. Did it work? Wow, the sound is so low. Hmm, what's the other effect? Once per turn to your main phase, return all spell and traps your opponent controls to the hand. When a monster effect is activated on your opponent's side of the field, while you control two more fusion monsters, quick effect, you can destroy that monster. Hmm, not how bad. Hmm, do they have any kaiju files? Nope. And they're not gonna get any counters. I'll use this in order to add a, an avatar card for my graveyard to my hand. Cool. And then I'll also activate Scarlet Sanguin, the male avatar. What are you guys talking about? To set Conquistador of the Golden Lands. And then, ooh, do I have the level 10 trends in here? <gasps> I do! Your opponent cannot target light monsters you control to the end of the effects once per turn during your standby phase. This one has 3200 attack, that's not enough. Can I go into Big Boy? I can go into Big Boy. Hey, right, thanks for the resubscribe, Thyme Numbers. We destroy that, and dual avatar invitation. Um. One second. Let's go into this card real quick. 3,200 attacks. And then we go into Big Libe. 
who should have more attack points than my opponent at 4,000 baseline. Ooh, I can go even further beyond. No, I can't. I'll activate dual avatar invitation, discard law of the normal, summon three tokens, and then use two of them to go into feet. Summon a monster, yeah. Feet number one, feet number two. Neat. Use another one. I need to check my extra deck. I don't think I can. What's the effect? You can destroy that many monsters your opponent. Oh, I guess I can't do that. Well, let's just go into the battle phase and attack. I need two monsters in order to have the big damage. And I know his two cards in hand aren't anything too scary. I can't believe I bet on a kaiju player. Did you think my feet deck would lose? This deck is legit. Against the kaiju deck, I guess. <laughs> Seems more proper. Hey, Dulux, nice to see you. Hello there, Iced Tea. Monster Reborn? Oh, no. Well, whatever. I knew I could trust you with my points. Good, good. Uh, let me uh, see here. Did it save? Here, what do you mean your bucket's empty? No, it's not. He just brought back his card. Um, has activated the kaiju files again. Let's see. Congratulations, you played yourself. Let's turn up the volume a little bit. Save. Congratulations, you played yourself. Okay, let's test it. Uh, how do I do that again? I think it's just like really low so you can't hear it. Why is it so low? The other one seems to be working no problem. Here, I'll turn it up to one. There, now you can hear it. What was the other one causing problems? Sad violin? You can hear it, it's just low. I'll turn it up a little bit. Okay, look at him choke, I think was the other one. It's my opponent, right? I'm not keeping him waiting. Yeah. That one still works. I don't want that one to be loud. That one pisses me off. Of course, that's why it, it's there. How can we activate Dreadnought's ability? Because it only makes attacks on monsters, right? Once per turn, detach the material. For us this turn, you can only it's declare an attack with this card. Make a number of attacks on monsters. Yeah, he only attacks monsters. Uh, when a monster effect is activated on your opponent's field, while you control two or more fusion monsters, you can destroy that monster. Uh, neat. So if I use the ability, I would have hit for less damage than if I had just attacked normally. That's why I didn't use it. Okay, so I can use this to bounce all the cards again. That way they don't get any kaiju counters. Whoa, that's actually pretty good. Okay, and 4,000 for big damage. And 17 and 2,000. Can I look at the gamble deck? Sure, I can show you the gamble deck real quick. Okay, the blurps should be working now. I just tested them all. Edit deck. Feet is too strong. Yeah, the feet deck was absolutely killing it. Change deck. Here's the gamble deck if you want to look at it. I'll be right back. I need to use the restroom. <laughs>
do we? It's crazy how you can see how small it gets when you leave. It's spooter food now. Okay. Spriggan Time Thief. Did you wash your hands? Of course I did. I wash my hands like a million times a day. He's a spooter food. Why do you attack with your lower damage first? Because I'm old school and I remember the days when everybody played Gorgs. Do you have an I My anime list? A link, please? Yeah, I do have one. I haven't updated it in like a year though. But it still should have like 500 plus animes on it. Easy win. Wow, I am winning so much today. Oh, I ranked up after deranking at the start of this because I was losing too much. What is it? My anime list. Okay. Man, it I can't tell you how much more fun it is just playing normal decks as opposed to that event. Uh, how do I link my anime list again? So if I go to... I'm logged in. Am I going first? No. Ah, here we go. Oh, I finished those animes. Oh, I gave... So the last time... Oh, Arte was pretty good. Okay, here it is. <laughs> Oh, I didn't copy. Are you a Twitch partner now? No, I'm not a Twitch partner. I don't want to be. If I was a Twitch partner, then they wouldn't let me stream on YouTube anymore because they're garbage and stinky. And they smell bad. Mods? Normal? What about the mods? I dominated normal rares with BLS. A Max C, huh? You think a Max C can stop me? I can't read. Spriggan's watch. Uh, add a Spriggan card from your deck to your hand. Yeah, I'll add um, Rocky, and then I'll send Captain Sargas to the grave for a 500 boost. Activate this effect. We'll send brothers to the grave. <clears throat> Bring out Merrymaker. Uh, activate Merrymaker's effect, but not brothers because I don't want to summon any other cards. Send Branga to the grave, and then I'll attach both. Oh, there's three I can attach. I'm going to attach all three of them. I see you like Baruto more than Naruto, and I am disgusted. Oh, did I do that as a joke? <laughs> Normal Naruto is better than Boruto. Well, that's like saying... You know... Burger King is better than McDonald's. It's still fast food. You gave it an H, which is way too high? Yeah, that is way too high. I don't know what I was thinking. Uh, you can add a Spriggan card from your deck to your hand. This allows me to add back Spriggan's watch, right? I'm about to find out. Nope! You would think I'd know my deck better than that. I even read it a little bit. So it's a Spriggan monster or the field spell, right? Yeah, you can target a great sand sea Gungoldia. Or a Spriggan monster. Okay. What's happening here? I'm winning. Who's your waifu in Monotagari? I don't really uh, do that. If you mean who's the best girl, though, I have no idea. Oh, yeah, I do. Kaiki. Kaiki's the best girl. How did I forget? 
What's your opinion on the uh, important topic, indeed is wrong? He gave it an 8, which is too high. Didn't restart the bar. Didn't restart what? What are you guys talking about? El Shadal Fusion is activated, so I can activate the Max C. Is that the Snake Girl? Kaiki is the dude who helped solve the Snake Girl's problem. If you've watched Monotagari second season, you would understand why he's the best. Do you know the way? Any Kombru effect? <coughs> hmm. Someone deleted a clay fort lore. El Shadal Construct! Whoa, we just went straight for it. Construct can send a Shadal monster from their deck to the grave. Beast allows them to draw a card. Uh, I don't really need to negate that. So I won't. Construct best girl. What are they going to do? Send dragon and pop my back row? Go for it. See if I care. Squamata. What are they going to do? Send dragon and pop my back row? See if I care. Do you know the way? Sure. Why not? Okay, what else is he going to send? He sent a Squamata. Kaiki is so cool in second season. When Hanamantagori, he gets better. Oh, I haven't finished it yet. No spoilers. Booting replicator mode. Yeah. This? I don't even know what this card does. Target shadow monster in your graveyard. Spells up in face up, face down defense position. You can banish this card and one shadow card from your graveyard and activate one of the following effects. Change a face down monster you control face up. <clears throat> Mary Maker will activate its effect to go crazy. Send a card to the graveyard. Sure, we'll send Iron Dash, then activate the Great Sand Sea in order to prevent it from attacking again. I think that should stop it from attacking. Deluxe says you won't be a VTuber, and here we are. I'm not a VTuber. This is a punishment. Now, oh, come on. If you had Harpy's Feather Duster, why wouldn't you have just used it earlier? What the hell, man? Frozen Lady is Justice, apparently. I love punishment VTubers. Me too. Activate Iron Dash from the grave. Sure. To the field? No, to my hand. Mary Maker comes back. I have two cards on the field. I need to get rid of them if I want to Lightning Storm. Hmm. Hmm. I can use Branga from the grave. I can also normal summon Regulator in order to special summon Time Thief Adjuster from my hand. Can I deck where you're running? My brain lacks nothing. It's Springins. So now you care about spoilers when you haven't seen it? Psh, name one anime that I spoiled. Go ahead, I'll wait. Oh, they're gonna go into a uh, window to lock out my shit. And since I no longer have infinite impermanence, I can't stop it. Hunter, Hunter, I didn't, I didn't do that. You guys are lying. You guys are a bunch of liars. The world God only knows. Nope, none of that happened. Well, sh shoot. Activate onto Merry Maker, I guess. 
God damn it. He just had to go and freaking use Harpy's Feather Duster during the end phase. Brand good to attach all of them to Mary Maker for no reason. His attack is too low to beat over Winda at this point. Because I need the field spell card. Hmm, I could attach even more. Go into the battle phase. Sure, let's just attack into his face down card. I think this is probably going to be a loss. Oh no. Special summon a Shadow monster from your deck? Oh. I thought that was something else. That's fine. Hmm. We say the X in the name Hunter X Hunter. I like saying the X in the name. I know it's probably not proper, but I do it anyway. What are you gonna do? Destroy one target on the field? What are you gonna destroy? My Mary Maker? Go for it. See if I care. Because now I can use Branga's effect to banish itself. As well as Mary Maker. In order to perform a search. Hmm. It's Brigand's Booty. Okay, and then activate Booty in order to add the Field Spell card to my hand. Wait, if I had added the Field Spell card earlier. I could have beat over El Shadal Winda. Oh my god, I had an out this whole time and I'm just stupid? Oh. Oh. Can Springins beat over 2800 attack? I can just destroy it. It's not really a big deal. Oh. Damn it. Hi, YouTube. This isn't going on YouTube. None of the ones that the model has are going on YouTube. I wish this thing would stop moving with me. Activating booty? Damn it. I can't believe I could have beat over window this whole time. VTuber obviously misplays. I'm not a VTuber. I don't know why you guys get this incorrect assumption. Damn YouTube channels is already dead, not getting any more duels. Exactly. Is that Sakura? Who's that? I love some spriggin' booties. No look at him chokes. Got my VTuber logs. Top tens. Shut up. I'm not doing any of that. They can't win this turn, can they? He's a pro Yu-Gi-Oh player who is a VTuber. I am a pro Yu-Gi-Oh player, but I'm not a VTuber. I don't know where you guys get that incorrect assumption from. Uh-oh. Direct attack for 2,800 points of damage. Uh, if this card is sent to the graveyard, you can add a Shadal card from your deck or graveyard to your hand, then discard one card. Can't attack directly because you were brought out with Schism, idiot. I'm not a VTuber, said the VTuber. I don't know why you guys keep calling me a VTuber. Like, literally makes no sense. Hmm. So I just realized because this is activated, I can't actually freaking do anything. Okay, I'll discard this card. Go into Exablower. Yeah, Exablower. What are you gonna do about this? 
How are you going to deal with 2,600 attack? Oh, shit. Oh, no. I'll be right back. before I come back to the mic. Alright, so I lost to, uh, what did I lose to? It was punishment, right? I think I lost to a timeout. Okay, so what happened was I may have rubbed my eye before I had washed my hand after touching the chip. So I went to just, uh, clean it out real quick. I was going to lose anyway. Punishments and Construct to add an L Shadow Fusion. Left on turn 10. Let's see what the punishment is. <laughs> what is it? <coughs> That's it? Easy. I can turn off the, sp the, the spider. Oh, that's, that's a double spider. There we go. I turned it off. You see? that That's what was re redeemed, was turning it off. Make VTuber model big. I can just go to the moon for that. Hello. This is big, right? I'm looking at my screen over here. I have to like move this thing moves too much I don't like it close enough let's spin again what is it master pack chat decides Gamble deck. Well, I can't do anything because that's my last duel of the day. I guess I'm just not doing anything. You guys, that's it. That's all of it. It's time to go. There's nothing. Oh, I could just release the tsunami thing. I'll, I'll release the... <laughs> Here, I'll release the tsunami thing. That's an appropriate punishment. Okay. So I have a tsunami clip. I think it's just called I'm Sorry. Punishment Karaoke? Oh no, it's called Punishment Karaoke. Okay, I'll, I'll put the video live. There. That's the final punishment, okay? I'll post it in chat so you guys can see that it just went live right now. There. Oh my god, that chip was annoying. I thought I was gonna die. Thanks for the stream. Yeah, I think this one was much better than the, the past two. Man. Those, those last two streams with the normal rare event? Those are some garbage streams. They were just absolutely awful. Some of the worst dreams I've ever had. 
I did tell myself I would stop talking about the quality of streams on stream because that's also bad. So this is the last time you'll hear me talk about this, but... Oh my goodness gracious. I like them. They were garbage. I kept losing all the time. I was just being irritated. Only 2,000 normal pair of points to go. Yeah, I, I like I like dueling a lot better when it's these kinds of decks. Next time I'll probably be playing the raw deck. Maybe I'll play, play that tomorrow. I just miss my hand traps and everything. The one today was fine. I almost died eating the chip. Well, I didn't almost die. That's an exaggeration. It was definitely tough eating that chip, though. ABC Union deck? Heck no. Okay, who else is online right now? Mogu! Ooh, Mogu! She's playing Mario Kart? Oh my god, she's probably raging. You guys have to go watch Mogu, she's hilarious. The silent code? Or Mogu? You guys will like Mogu, she's hilarious. Don't worry, I'll be sure to delete the Tsunami video later on tonight. Make a poll? Make a poll for what? 